San Francisco held its second annual Juneteenth kickoff event at City Hall today. ABC 7 News reporter Ryan Curry shows you why those at the event say this is about the continued need for progress. San Francisco welcomed a weekend of black culture with a City Hall event Friday. Mayor London Breed hosted the second annual Juneteenth kickoff event, a celebration of black music and art that commemorates what happened on June 19, 1865, when Union soldiers arrived in Galveston, Texas, and told the enslaved black Americans there they had been freed by the Emancipation Proclamation two years earlier. This is just the beginning for our people. This unity is what's going to continue to bring us together to share and shed the light that we want to be living in. Rodney Jackson Jr. is a Broadway performer from San Francisco who performed at City Hall on Friday. He says seeing San Francisco embrace Juneteenth is something he has been waiting for his entire life. Today's a celebration of all the diaspora of how the black people and the black culture supports the San Francisco Bay Area. San Francisco city officials say this weekend is about both joy and progress towards equality. We should be celebrating freedom, Juneteenth, the accomplishments of black people 24-7. This is the second year Juneteenth has been recognized as a national holiday. Community leaders are hoping events like the large festivals this weekend in the Fillmore and Bayview districts will help more people understand this holiday is not just about black history, but American history. I want to be the and live in representation of that, the embodiment of our people thriving, the embodiment of Juneteenth and celebrating our freedom. Like, this is it. In San Francisco, Ryan Curry, ABC7 News.